Yes, I'm a big believer in nose to tail for a couple of reasons, and I'm gonna, I suspect that Brother Repair feels the same way. If you're gonna kill an animal, it is only polite to not waste it. I mean, you know, for years we, we, we killed animals. You know, I, I'm not exactly, you know, I'm not exactly a PETA member here, but I feel that if you're gonna kill an animal for your pleasure or your, or your, your nutrition, it's just kind of rude to you know, take out the sirloin, the filet, uh, the rib, uh, and, and grind the rest up for either burger or, or, or pet food. Also, I happen to believe as a, as a longtime cook and chef, to me, I'm not really interested in steak anymore. To me, real cooking is somebody who can take a shank or a tail or a cheek and, 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 and turn it into something wonderful. So the answer is, I just, I like that stuff. That's real cooking for me, the story of cooking I mean, what's the history of French gastronomy? All those great dishes, uh, you know, what, Blanquette, uh, you know, uh, croque yes. vin, uh, these were answers to some, you know, how do we use all of it? How do we waste nothing? Um, Absolutely, yes. And, and I think uh, over the, the centuries, all cultures, and especially the Chinese and, and the French, have learned how to, uh, because of, of difficult times, I've learned how to use every part of the animals and make them delicious. And I, I think it's, um, for instance, if you go in the southwest of France, they take a, a duck and from the feet to the beak, everything is edible, a flavor and so on. And, and uh, as, a, as a chef, it's a lot of fun to cook those uh, uh, sometimes challenging parts of the animal. Uh, it's much more uh, exciting than to flip a steak on the grill, that's for sure.